Kind of scale guys, next is here, welcome back to Destiny 2! And today in Destiny 2 is kind of a special day, there's no like event or anything like that, but we are getting a VDoc from Bungie themselves, so I'm super hyped to watch that later. Basically, it's going to be going through the new DLC, Beyond Light, which is coming out obviously November 10th. Super hyped, super excited, means more content basically, which is really good for the game. But last week in the TWAB we got the This Week at Bungie, we basically got given some details about the sandbox changes that are going to be happening in Beyond Light, and from those changes, we can actually start to look at weapons that might actually be good come next season some things that like you should probably use straight away or have your eye on just in case because it could be meta one of them is going to be the ace of spades hand cannon now this is my bait this is the king this basically got me luna's hell Mountaintop, Recluse, this was my bay. okay? This was my go-to weapon in any sort of competitive environment. Now, the reason the Ace of Spades might be coming more relevant and might be returning as meta is basically because 150 or PM hand cannons, they are getting nerfed in terms of they're getting turned into 140. So, the lightweight frames, they're going to be 140 hand cannons, meaning they're going to be the same rate of fire as these. Might have better handling stuff, but the range is going to be less than, obviously, the Ace of Spades and stuff. So, it basically means the adaptive frames 140s, they might get a resurgence of being basically the best sort of hand cannons there is obviously the sunshot which is going to stay 150 but it's going to be the only 150 rpm hand cannon in the game but it's not just the lightweight frames that are getting somewhat nerfed they're also nerfing the nine hunger frame sort of weapon so the adaptive frames auto rifle 600 rpm they're getting a damage reduction so you might not be as frustrated coming up against them anymore so the ace of spades it looks like it might be one of the top tier weapons come next season now the thing is the ace of spades it's not changing Everything else around it is changing, but the Ace of Spades is not changing. So this thing, we can test it out now, see if it's any use right now in Crucible. And if it is good, you can just tell how good it's going to be come the next season. But in saying that, without further ado, let's go into some Crucible and try the Ace of Spades out. Alrighty, so we're going to be on the Retribution first of all. This is obviously the Ace of Spades. It is a pretty dope looking gun. It has such cool animations and stuff. It's like the last word in terms of flicks around and stuff. And as I said, this was a king. This was uh, the weapon back in the day. This used to be actually in freaking nuts now obviously it has got changed in terms of nerfs and stuff like that so it did get changed uh i don't know when what time it came to change that but it basically got changed because this thing was returned stupidly good stupidly good the momentum more and stuff used to absolutely wreck people but you'll see with the momentum more oh damage pricks oh my god okay this guy is running at me oh bro 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 bro, bro. oh i didn't kill him i was hoping for the health i was hoping for the health regen oh but look at this damage. Oh, my God. The thing about it is that, as I said, it did get nerfed. The momentum more used to basically just give it, like, max range. Okay, this guy does not. <gasps> what? How does that kill me? But, yeah, the momentum more used to do, like, 90-something damage with Vengeance. The one-eyed mask and stuff. It used to actually just destroy people. Now, this, I have high-caliber rounds and stuff, bro. Oh, oh. Oh, we got him. We got him. Oh, no, bro. Bro. Don't do it. Don't do it to me. Oh, he didn't know. He, he is unawares, but I keep missing. Oh, my God. If I died there, I would have been so mad. But we are destroying. Like, look at it. Once it gets to Momentum Ori's, oh, my God. Does a freaking destroy booties. Oh, my God. It's oh, my God. This guy right there. But okay, we're doing, like, absolutely next to no damage to him. But we'll get this guy. Thank you for the heal, basically. Uh, we're going to Momentum this guy. Oh, my God. There's so many people. So many people. So little bullets. But you can just see how freaking nuts this weapon is. Like, it used to be... Oh, my God. Okay, that guy is just AFK or something. But this thing used to be just so good. And the only reason, like, it kind of came... Like, kind of less use and stuff is literally just because 150s have better time to kill. It's legit the only reason people just kind of... Start, obviously, handling and stuff as well. But it was the main reason that this guy has a momenti Mori. And I can see where you're going, bro. But there's teammates everywhere. Oh, my God. We got him, though. We got them. Oh, my... Oh. Heal, 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 heal. But like, oh my god, this freaking shoulder charge revoker. I'm just getting sniped and everything. We're getting destroyed, bro. Obviously, this has range and stuff on it. Oh my god, this guy here. Bro, don't worry, bro. I got your back. Oh, I don't have your back. What? What is going on? There's two people here. Oh my god. Okay, we got him. We got him. But like, oh, that's a shotgun for you and nonsense. But you'll see, even at range, it's pretty damn good. Now, oh my god. There's, just, there's people everywhere. Okay, screw you guys. What? Screw you. Oh my god, I actually missed that jump. <laughs> Oh my god, bro, bro, that was such a bad super. I mean, we're both, we both suck. My super was worse, but like, whew. Oh, dude, right off spawn. Thank you very much. Triple tap, and you're dead. The momenti more procs, and then we just destroyed that. Freaking heavy ammo, for real. Just one taps you with the nade launcher, but legit, once you get those momentis going, it's just so much damage. And it's so good to stack, because... 
realistically, if you're using Momentis and stuff, you're gonna kill the dude before your Momenti runs out because you get six bullets. And so you basically, every time you get a kill with it, you get to reload and you get your bullets back. Your Momenti perks back and stuff. And that is a guy with freaking heavy again. This guy has my number. As I said, this did get nerfed a couple of times. Like this used to be able to basically, if I have Momenti's proc and stuff, I used to be able to switch my weapon out and switch back. Now if I switch, I don't want to right now because I'll lose obviously my bullets. Now if you switch, you lose your bullets. Which kind of sucks. If I could actually see what the hell is going on, I might get a kill. But the bullet nerf and that sort of nerf to the Momentis and stuff, it kind of did, kind of killed it a bit for me in terms of just obviously consistency and stuff. I need to heal. There's a guy burning in there. Oh my, oh my god. Nope, 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 nope. But yeah, it kind of killed the weapon a bit because obviously you just couldn't use it with obviously a shotgun or something like that if you really need to get a kill or something and they're rushing you. There's just stuff like that that kind of nerfed it. Oh my god, the guy I ran away from, he's still in it. How are you still in your super? My god. Oh, we'll get this guy though. We're at a headshot. Get that quick reload, the animation. It's not, it's like, just look at that. 90, 90, 90. Freaking deleted. That is, just, it's just so beautiful. It's honestly freaking dope. It's also because of, it's like just a bigger kill clip. Oh, no, no, don't die. Oh, it's alive. We're gonna get the guy. I'm just literally swinging this corner and getting like two people. Okay, this guy can burn for me. Oh, shotgun. Oh my god, I feel so nostalgic right now. Going back to this weapon is honestly so beautiful. Now, this guy is heavy, so can you just die for me? Screw you and your heavy nonsense. Oh no! Oh, oh. That guy, that guy's mauling. He's mauling, and I didn't get away, but that guy, he, he is mad. He is so mad. He should have killed me there. But the nostalgia of this weapon, it, it literally brings me back to Forsaken, when Destiny was probably at one of its best states. In terms of just weapons and stuff like that. It was like the first time Destiny 2 actually felt like a good game. Die for me. Thank you. And there's got to be guys here. Thank you. And there's a guy here. Oh my god. He actually died. Oh. oh. We're actually killing people. So we're going to run back. We're going to try to run back to our own spot. And that guy is teabag shooting me. What a freaking Monte Carlo. What is this game? I leave for like a week. And this crap starts happening. Who's, who's, who brought the teabag shooters in? Who brought them in? Guys, I, I publicly think we should publicly shame whoever thought teabag shooting was a good mechanic in the game. Okay. Can we just... Oh, okay. Here's a teabag shooter. And screw you, buddy. As long as I aim my shots. Get those headshots. And we need to heal. This guy with a shoulder charge or a shot. Couldn't have been even worse than a shoulder charge is a freaking fist of havoc. Out of everything I was thinking of, I was not thinking that a freaking fisting was going to come straight into my ass and absolutely destroy me. They get this guy though. Like, oh, just look at the consistency. It's honestly, it's, it's the, when you start getting headshots, they would miss. And that is where the 150s do kind of destroy it right now. Is that he sprayed me down so fast he could barely aim. And that's why if you get high Cali with a 150, it was just nuts. But that's the thing. With them turning into 140s now, Ace is going to be nuts with high Cali rounds. Momenti Mori. Quick reload if you're a headshot kill. Basically outlaw. It's going to be dope. 34 kills though. 2.83 efficiency. We kind of we get stomped on. But legit, once the 150s turn to 140s, this is going to contend meta, my friend. Alrighty, we're going in again. This time, Alter Flames, though. But you know what we're going in with. We're going in with the Ace of Spades. Honestly, this gun is a dope. It's going to be... Look, this guy's using it as well. Everyone is preparing. This gun is definitely going to be meta or up there with the meta. Come, obviously, beyond night. Because when 150s, as I said, once they get nerfed, there's nothing stopping these from doing any damage. Oh, my God. I'm burning alive. But there's nothing stopping this gun from reaching. Basically, it's Super Saiyan full potential. That's the only thing holding back right now with the 150s. Hey, this guy needs to die for me. Thank you. Oh, my God. Dip, 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 dip. Right, just... Don't beat me, don't beat me. Just let me get my momentis. And then I'll snipe a dude. Come here, bro. Oh, my God. This guy right here. Oh, we got him. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, we gonna aim on this guy. Come here, bro. Oh, bro. Come on. Bro, 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 bro. No scoped. Dead. Oh, mama. But we have one bullet left to get headshot with. And I'm... Oh, my God. Okay, we're going to just walk away. You know, when you do so bad, sometimes you're best off just walking away and probably jumping off the cliff there. But you know what? I'm going to survive just for a little bit longer. It wasn't that bad, but sometimes it, it calls for it. And this guy is... I don't think he's lagging, but... Oh, look at that explosion. I also do have the catalyst on this. So if you want to know what that is... Oh, my God. No, bro. Okay, we lost some momentis because... Oh, my God. I was not even watching. But I lost some momentis because I switched weapon. But I do have the catalyst on this as well. Now, you get the catalyst, obviously, from uh, Crucible and Strike Playlist. So, basically, just play the game in Crucible or PvE or um, Crucible. And you will get a random chance at getting the catalyst. And the catalyst is easy. Just kill a bunch of mofos with the weapon. And basically, what it does is it increases the damage Firefly does. So, 
Nothing really fancy. Nothing, to, well, to be honest, nothing at all, to be honest. Because <laughs> the Firefly in PvP, we need a dip. But the Firefly in PvE, or PvP, it helps sometimes, but it's not going to be the main reason you use this weapon and stuff. Now, that guy is too far away. There's a guy capping flag. Where is this guy? Oh, my God. Bro oh, my God, he's flying high. He is flying high. We're going to get him, though. Give me momentis. Do your worst. Oh, my, oh. Oh, there's two guys there. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> we got the second. Oh, I do not know, but we're going to get this guy as well. Oh, my God. The 66 at like 100. Oh, we got the second guy. Oh, my God. They, it's just nuts. Once you get the moment, he's going. Oh, it's creamy. That is what it is. We're going to just destroy this guy's HP, though. Give me that quick uh, reload. And did the rest of your team spawn? No, you're just an unlucky soul. He spawned right beside me. Absolutely slay. So, like you'll see, just damage upon damage. And oh my god. Oh no, I didn't want to jump. I wanted to rift up. I wanted to rift up. Oh my god. Can I cannot. Okay, you know what? Screw it. There is a lot of people here. We're going to get this guy. We're going to get this guy. And this guy. Oh, mama. We just destroyed them all. Oh my god. Oh no. Bro. Bro. Oh, he just protected the president. Oh my god. No. Oh, I need a dip. I need a dip because I have no bullets. <laughs> I don't know how I'm still alive. You know what? You literally never ask questions. As they always say, if you survive some stupid way, just don't ask questions. Now, this guy is weak. Thank you. That is where Momentis come in handy. So, if I get a double headshot, obviously, a one-shot body is going to be next. But, like... Oh, can I... Okay, I did get him. I was going to say, this guy's head is legit the only thing I can see. And I didn't know what I was hitting. We'll need this, though. Come and burn him, burn him, burn him. Oh, bruh, bruh, bruh. <laughs> Oh my god, now I don't get my ace and my mentees back, but we're gonna get this guy. Oh uh, no, no! <laughs> Legit, the last two games, I died more to shoulder charges than a weapon. It's it's pretty nuts, to be honest. But yeah, once Beyond Light comes back, this is legit. This is going to be what PvP is. It's legit the only thing that's going to happen. Now we need to dip. Oh, we need to get out of here so fast. Oh! Huh! Oh! Oh, no, 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 no. Now we're going to rift it up, and now we got free reign on this dude. He's going to ch shoulder charge me. Oh, God, I had to take a chance there. I was like, I was lagging a bit, I think, on the other guy. So I took a chance that I'd actually kill him. But, oh, my God. Look how far away I am with the Momentis. I'm just able to nail him. And the thing is, what makes Momentis so special is that if I'm using Kill Clip, it's like I've got a set time before. Oh, my God, that guy just annihilated me. But I got a set time before I have to, like, run out of my Kill Clip. With Momentis, I get a six stack, and as long as I don't switch, switch my weapon, it's Gucci. I am sticking with it forever. That is legit the best thing about it. Now, this guy has... Uh, uh, get up. There we go. Hoo -hoo. Screw you and your super. Oh, my God. Okay. I didn't say screw you, but we got we're going to try to run away. Is that still chasing me? <laughs> we did it, boys. We got away from it. Now, I lost Momentis because I switched because I got scared. Oh, my God. It's too people here. Oh, God. You know what? Sometimes you just got to do that. And then sometimes you got to do this as well. And now you got to dip. And we out. <laughs> he won't know. Shh. He won't know. He won't know. He won't know. He knows. Oh. Okay, that guy whiffed so badly. I mean, come on, bro. How do you miss that? I was a one shot, but we're going to get this guy. No, we won't because my kill got robbed. We are out. We're out here slaying, though, honestly. Legit, once you bring me back to a weapon I like to use... My god, is it just like annihilation? All right, this guy with hammers going around, so we're gonna do this. Hey, bro, we're gonna take you out because screw you and your hammers. We're gonna come on. Is this guy right here? Oh, he's right here. Oh, this guy right here. <laughs> what is going on? I do not know. Oh my god, no. Oh my god, that's hammers. That is hammers. Oh, oh, he's weak. He's weak. Oh, we got him. We're on a dank kill streak right now. Oh, we're, we're actually, uh, as I say, we're out here slaying it. This guy with freaking. Sniper, I was trying to dodge the sneaky sniper. As I said, I'm playing a while, but it's not just like I'm coming back. It's just when you went and start using the weapon, that's so much fun. It's just like it makes the game so much fun as well. And this guy is gonna be here. Oh, we got him! We actually got him. He is a salty uh, mofo right now, but you know what? We don't care about that because we got an absolutely nuts kill on that guy. We'll try and destroy this guy. Oh, headshot, bruh. Like, there's so much damage going with it. It's just, like, headshot central when you get, like, adaptive frame. There's some aim assist, I think, on this. All right, this game is nearly over and stuff, so we're gonna have to try to get, like, a bunch of kills on these guys. Oh, he's trying to hide. He's trying to dip. But you know what, bro? You ain't dipping from the ace of spades. I didn't even moment he's on. I was able to nail him pretty far away. Hey, this guy is a cold and not RGN7. What is this guy using? But, yeah. 
At range? Okay, yeah, I am going out. Well, I already killed him there as well. Let's be honest, that was pretty far. At range, though, you're still going to struggle with hand cannons, but, like, obviously, they're not going to be mapping people, but this one boasts no super good range. He's got super good range, of course, when you got the momentum and stuff going on it. That guy's just AFK, so I'll take that kill. But it's honestly, as I said, this is going to be nuts. It's legit just because... Okay, there's a guy weak there. What? Okay, they kind of just grouped up or something. Oh, my God. There's people every... Come on, chase me, bro. Chase me. Chase me. <laughs> I know I'm a scrub. I'm an ace. Our freaking Bell Winters lie scrub sometimes. But yeah, the, honestly, the ace is just dope. It's bring me back to uh, the obviously Forsaken DLC. We obviously dropped to 40. 49 kills, 6.1 tree efficiency. It, that does not tell a story. I mean, my team compared to me, what was going on. But that does not tell a story about how good the ace is. I don't know what will. The ace is just a dope-ass weapon. It's honestly nuts. Alrighty, so we are gonna be on a fragment. You're probably wondering, another game? What is this? But yeah, I am using the controller right now, so you'll see by just my speed and stuff walking around. I'm using a hand cannon with a controller. Who knew what this would be like? I am on PC still, though. So it's controller on PC, but um, with next gen coming around and stuff, this is actually the closest I'll get to it anyway. But yeah, it's just, oh my god, why are they all having a big gack right there? What the hell was that? Oh my god. Hey, can we just nade? Oh my god, it's right here. Right here, right here, boys. Boys, boys, boys. Oh, we got the kill. <laughs> but yeah, you'll see the speed is a bit slower. And hand cannons, obviously, on console and stuff, there's a bit more of a recoil effect to it. So it's harder to stay accurate with these things over for long periods and stuff. So, I understand why other people and stuff... Oh my god, what? How is that gonna dead? Oh my god, I'm probably gonna die now, I'm dying. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna get shotgun right in uh, the face by this dude. Oh my god, Cosmo, please die, thank you. But yeah, hand cannons in general on console, they're just never really used. Now, that guy just deep dived. Okay, I know one of these are invisible, bro. Oh, he's right there. He's right. <laughs> he aced the space me. <laughs> And just recalling these sorts of hand cannons, it takes a lot more time and skill and stuff like Don't that. So it's not as easy you to equip as obviously fun. like nine hunger and stuff, and just completely destroy a dude and stuff. But we'll kill this guy, get those momentis going, and we snowball from here. Now there is absolutely okay. They lost a the player. That is why I'm like feeling a bit like there's absolutely no one around. But guys, come on, leave someone for me. My momentis. Did I switch my weapon or did I didn't get momentis? Did I? Oh, we'll nail this guy though. Whoo, he just destroyed him. But yeah, this guy's using a shotgun, took my kill. But obviously, the thing about using hand cannons in console is that once you get good with these sorts of weapons on console, you're a different beast altogether. You start to absolutely wreck. And that's why the dire promise. The dire promise is so good, obviously, on console as well. And this guy is pretty far away. Can you just. Oh, that's a sniper. Oh, he's burning. He's dead. <laughs> okay, trash man, stood in my grenade. Why don't you? But the thing, yeah, as I was saying, console and stuff. Dark Promise is so good because it increased mobility, increased speed, super good handling and stuff, which is one of the killers, obviously, on console in terms of. Takes a little bit for me to aim and stuff. Now we're gonna absolutely nail this guy. Oh, he's so weak! And he's dead. Oh, no, 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 no. Whoo, he's alive. Be out here living. I don't have momentum, so I'm actually gonna have to get close again. There it is, people. Oh, my God, really? Really, game? They're all there. Can we just rift it up a bit? Uh, 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 there's so many people everywhere. I don't know who to go for. We're gonna get momentous going though. This is it. Come on, this guy was sniping. How is this guy not on my radar? What the hell? Okay, I'm looking at my radar and there's just no one there, but we're gonna do this. Oh, no, 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 no. We need a dip. Okay, you know what? Screw it. Oh, don't tell me I used it. Don't tell me. Say it isn't so. Say it isn't freaking so. I wouldn't say it's gonna be bad on PC or on controller or console and stuff, but. With how good auto rifles, like auto rifles aren't getting absolutely wrecked or anything. They are getting a slight nerf to the 600 RPM in terms of damage. But I feel like it's not going to deter auto rifles on console. I think console is still going to be an auto rifle meta, sadly, because our, at the moment as well, Hankan has never really made it into the meta anyway and stuff like that. And that is a guy with hammers. But we're, whoo, mama, we got the ace of spades, bruh. That is the last words, but hey, we got him. All right, he's gonna be a person here. He's gonna have a fist to havoc or something, but we're gonna headshot him. What? What? Is that an aid? I have no idea. But we are burning him. But yeah, once you get the momentum, we should be able to snowball. This is it. Snowballing with the controller. Now, this guy is just AFK or something. What? I'm so confused about what's happening right now, but we're gonna get him. We're gonna get that guy. And there is a double kill. These guys just kind of stand still with, sh with snipers or something. This guy. What is going on? What is go? What is going on here? I mean, what the hell? There is a spectral blade or something coming here. No, it's not. It's just a guy who's gonna die for me. Thank you. Give me that kill. Thank you, momentis. I would have had a quicker reload if you could lag in, but you know what? We're gonna take it. We're gonna take it. We're gonna nail this guy. And <laughs> that's the triple tap you want to see with the aim assist, obviously controlling stuff as well. 
It would be obviously if you're used to like as I said, if you're used to this on controller and stuff, you will slay. Dude right here though, who just destroyed my teammate, but we're gonna get the kill. Give me those mementos. We need them. We need mementos, I think. God, I just can't get the kills. It's legit. I think it's just it's not even like they're miles away. Oh my god, that guy just got destroyed. This guy got destroyed as well. Can you just burn? Oh my god, there's people everywhere. Heal, bruh. Heal, we're gonna this guy behind me, this guy, okay, this guy right behind me, this guy right behind me, we're gonna get him. Oh my god, I'm so slow to turn, it's actually insane sometimes, but we're gonna get this guy. No, we're not, this guy is, bro, you know you can't shoot through the wall, oh my god, he got me because he has a, oh, he had to ignore his axe. You know what, if he died to a slug shotty, I don't mind sometimes, it's, you know, it's kind of, at least he's using a weapon that takes skill, you know. But yeah, I should have killed him, I was kind of playing with my food there, but look at that, the four tap body. From that range, just get headshots and stuff. We'll get this guy. Oh, no, no. Ah! Really, bro. Really? You're not going to let me have some fun, JB? You're just going to snipe me like that as soon as I pop my super? Oh, this has been a bit of a limp dick sort of game, hasn't it? This is literally falling from godhood from the last game to this. I mean, this has just been pretty bad. Pretty bad if I say so myself. But you know what? I will still say... I never think all our hand cannons are really sort of meta material for a console anyway. I mean, they're not bad or anything like that. It's just, if auto rifles are going to be useful, it's going to be guns that are easier, like pulses and stuff. They're most likely going to st uh, stick the landing on console and stuff. There's just no po real point in using hand cannons unless you live and breed hand cannons on console. Like, you really want to just... Because, obviously, they'll have, like, one of the best timed kills. If you just live and breed console, well it would be a good idea. But, hey, we still won. I kind of got carried, but, yeah. Good if you, obviously, practice hand cannons enough on controller, but I don't really use controller, so that's why I kind of sucked. Still gonna have good time to kill. Recoil isn't too bad. I just feel like overall, we, did, we didn't do too bad. 2.9 KD, 29 kills. I just feel like overall, it's not gonna be the meta. I think still on console, you're still probably gonna see your gnawing hungers and probably a vigilance swing. Well, that's it from me and the Ace of Spades and Cannon. What can I say? I mean, the proof is in the pudding. You can see I got 49 kills one game. We got like 30-something in the first. And then obviously 29, which is low-ish, but 29 kills using the controller for me, Honestly, is isn't bad. Like, you don't usually get high-scoring games on console anyway. I think that on console, though, it's probably not going to be better. It, it'll be good, and it'll be useful, and a lot of people will use it, obviously. If people are good with hand cannons. But I still think you're gnawing hunger and any sort of auto rifle, because they're not getting nerfed into the ground. They're getting a slight nerf. So they're still going to be optimal in terms of you can miss a few shots and still kill. Pulse rifles will probably be big on meta big on console too still but on pc definitely the ace of spades is going to be a weapon of choice because first of all it just has high cali rounds so sniper flinching all that sort of jazz super good for that secondly so much damage with menti mori it does so much at range as well it has really good range that anyway the reload is dope it has a magazine size of 13 it's just legit and this is the review i gave it back before forsaken this legit has everything there's a couple of weapons that I'm going to be checking out over the next few days and stuff that will be good. I think next season will be near to the meta or things you should be looking at. But the Ace of Spades is top of that list. And I am so happy this king is returning. But regardless, if you liked the video, trust like. And you want to see more content, subscribe. Have a fantastic day. And hopefully, I'll see you guys in the next one.